Mr. Kapoor wants to know if flexi debt funds are a better option in times of volatility. Yeah, so uh, if I understand you correctly, if I understood you correctly, then flexi debt fund basically is something you are talking about, I and mean, it's like it's and it's a new bond, it's fund, dynamic bond, bond fund, which of course makes sense. Basically, at at the moment as we stand, we still like durations. In our dynamic bond fund, we are running. Uh, much higher duration in case we come to a conclusion. So our base case is that you know 50 years fund rate cut, which is what I said in the beginning. At uh, so you know after those events play out, once we come to a conclusion that you know the rate cycle is over, we would certainly bring down the duration and you know try to look at the opportunity in the credit space. So that so investor wouldn't have to do anything. It's all would be done dynamically from the fund management end. The way we keep saying at Value Research that you know when it when investing in equity. Uh, for the long run, choose a multi-cap fund. So the fund manager, is, you know, gets the opportunity to invest where is where, where to invest in the most opportune way. Likewise, looks like you know, dynamic bond fund is the equivalent of the of the diversified yeah. mul the multi-cap <coughs> fund. But that you know, the fund manager is uh, opportunistically choosing which segment to emphasize in the portfolio. Yeah, and here I would of course like to emphasize that it's not that you know, our attempt is not to go right 100% of the time. We try to basically our we strive to generate that alpha and typically if we get it you know about 75 80 percent right it makes a lot of sense for our investors so they are a very hands-off way of investing for an income fund investor isn't it yeah, yeah.